Hello folks and welcome again to another Halo Fan for Life toy review. Uh, this time we actually have something that's not Halo related. It's actually, uh, well it is still Mega Bloks. It is the Despicable Me line. And in this case it is the blind boxed figures. Unlike Halo that has blind bag figures, uh, Despicable Me has the boxes as you can see here. So this is an example of one that you'll find on the shelves. Uh, just for scale size, you know, here's my hand in here. So the box is fairly big. Uh, even if you shake it, you know, you can't really tell what's in there. Uh, there it is, it's not taped, but uh, it is glued uh, on the top here and on the bottom as well. There is a code uh, that's right here imprinted on there, so if you're able to find all six codes, then you know you'll have all six of the, uh, the minions. I was able to find five of them, so we're going to take a quick look at those right here. Uh, these are still in a package and uh, I will build them and uh, and then show you those as well. Um, I'm not going to build them at the moment, I'm just going to show you them in the package. Oh wait, and before I get to that, I should show you that each one of the boxes comes with this little uh, fold out here that shows you what the six figures are. And these three here in green are the commons, the two blue here are the rare, and then the one yellow one, which is the purple evil minion, is the uh, ultra rare in this bunch here. So if you notice down on the bottom here, it shows you the six minions, but then it shows you this question mark. So I'm hoping this just means that, you know, these are mystery ones and that that's not a secret figure um, that I know of. Uh, and, and I actually have it on fairly good authority. Uh, there is no secret figures. So... Uh, or there are no secret figures, so it's just the six. Okay, so <clears throat> first off, uh, we'll see here. Uh, this is the short uh, minion, and this guy, if I can show you there, there we go. This is uh, it has the two-eyed short minion. That's a regular minion, a uh, regular Gru Workshop minion. Uh, this one, he, oh, and the only difference between him is that he's got a little white bow tie here. So... You know, really, that's not a big deal. This is a, a good little figure if you want to army build them so that you have a nice little army of uh, minions. All right, the next one is the short, fat minion. And he's also a two-eyed guy, and he comes with a banana. Look at that. Nana! <laughs> and same deal here. Um, you know, there's nothing, spe no special markings or anything on him, not even the little white uh, bow tie. So he would be another one that you might consider army building as well. Um, or squad building or minion building, whatever you want to call it. All right, the next one that is a common, uh, and again, those two are common as well. Uh, the next one that's common is the tall minion, and he comes with this little uh, beach uh, uh, getup right here. Um, now, remember that you can pop and swap these figures, so if you happen to get two of the tall ones and, say, two of the short ones, you could actually, the skinnies, both skinnies, you could switch uh, one for the other. This way you'd have a tall, regular Gru minion, and then you could have a short one with the beach wear. So, you know, you can do whatever you want there. All right. Now, I did get lucky. Uh, one of the uh, rares here I got, and as you can see, this is the one that has the blast on its face. It's got the little uh, uh, beaker right here. And uh, he is, uh, there you go, he's a one-eyed minion. So, in fact, now let me show you the... Uh, this fold out again here so you can see better what they look like again. So again, I have the tall one, here's the fat one, here is the short one, and then the short one with the blast faced right here. So that means that the last one I got is either the evil minion or uh, the disguised uh, minion to look like an evil minion. So what did I get? Did I get the rare or did I get the ultra rare? Well, I'm very happy I got the ultra rare! Woo -woo! So this one, the difference between this ultra or this evil minion and the other ones that I've shown in my written reviews is that this one is a one-eyed one, and here you can see there's a one eye. The other ones are two-eyed minions, uh, two-eyed evil minions. Oh, and by the way, he comes with a purple beaker there. You can see. So uh, the only one I'm missing then is the disguised. Uh, minion and he's a rare so hopefully I can find them uh, find him uh, I'd like to get a couple of extras of these guys uh, well certainly extras of the purple ones for a little building but then uh, the extras of the small and the tall ones so I can pop and swap and you know mix them up a little bit okay now I'm gonna do something that I've never done before and that is to 
uh, turn the video off for the moment, build the figures, and hopefully I can get these two videos to merge together because I'm going to build them and then show you them built. All right, here we go. Okay, if you're seeing this, that means that I was able to somehow figure out how to get these two videos to merge. So here we go. All right, so as you can see, all five of the figures are now built. And let's take a look at each one here. So again, here we have the two-eyed short minion with the little white bow tie. He comes with a camera. And, uh, you know, the, on the back here, by the way, there's this little hole, and it's with all the figures, and I imagine that at some point there's going to be some kind of like a, a backpack or something else that they'll have. Uh, you know, so, you know, uh, I guess Megablox is, uh, you know, has an intention to do something with that or put it there just in case. So anyways, again, here's the common guy. He's got this, uh, this nifty little camera you can see there. And, uh... I don't know if I can get the code to zoom in. Probably can't. All right, so that's that guy. All right, the next one, uh, here's the short, fat minion. And he's got this banana. And as you can see, there's a little white on the uh, inside part of the skin there. And uh, uh, he's pretty cool. He's got the little uh, spiked hair do there, uh, printed on, of course. And typical, again, same thing. He's a regular groom minion as well. All right. And then the last common is... Like I said, this is the the tall minion. Uh, all the tall minions have this uh, this spiky uh, little head uh, hair thing here. Uh, he comes with this ice cream cone. It's a buildable cone. Uh, you got the cone. The, the, this piece, this chocolate piece, comes off. Well, chocolate, whatever, and cherry or whatever you want to call it. Like I said, if you uh, if you were to get two of these guys, and two of these guys you could swap the uh, the bodies on them. Now, mind you, of course, the bow tie would show up on here. So, you know, if you get some kind of a paint remover, you'd be able to remove that, and then you'd have a short beach minion uh, like this. Uh, well, with that, uh, with that uh, shorts on. Okay, uh, we will go to the rare figure. And again, this is the one-eyed one. He's got, if you can see here, he has the parted hair. Um, we've only seen that uh, one other time so far in uh, all the other sets and he comes with this uh, green translucent beaker and as you can see uh, you know in fact here I'll move it a little bit you can see that this parts printed on the blasted part uh, behind this eye there uh, it's kind of funny he's kind of cute um, again uh, if you were to pop and swap the body uh, with another one that's a clean version, uh, you could have a regular version. Maybe you could put him with something else. I don't know. But uh, so you've got that. All right. And then the last one that I have, like I said, I don't have the purple disguised minion, but I did get this, uh, the rare or the rather the ultra rare uh, evil minion. And he comes with the purple beaker. And uh, as you can see, uh, it's hard to zoom in on this, but his little symbol here is an M for Macho or El Macho. Uh, he's got this wild hair, and you know it. You know it's it's actually you know something like you can you can do stuff with it. So you know I had him pretty fanned out here. You know uh, just so he looks like he, you know maybe he got blasted with his own uh, you know chemical right there. So um, that's it for these little guys. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to get the last one to complete the set. Uh, again, I don't believe that there's any secret figures, and in fact, I do have a good source for that that says that there's none. So, uh, if that's the case, then I'm only missing one. Hopefully you can find these right now, as of this video, they are at uh, Toys R Us for buy one, get one 40% off. Um, so, if you happen to find these very shortly after you watch this video and it's posted, uh, maybe you can get them on sale. Alright folks, well thanks again for uh, watching. Uh, click that like below if you wouldn't mind. Uh, if you're a Halo fan, go check out my blog at halofanforlife.com. Uh, this is Sal, and uh, we'll see you next time.